I'm dead. Yo, speaking of Westchester bias, we got two Westchester heads playing out right now. Crit and Alive Kim Baby. We've already seen this matchup tonight with Madasi and uh, Alive Kim. What, what do we hope that, that either player learned from the previous matchup? Well, I feel like Madasi, you know, had a semblance of an idea what to do against Eliakim, and now what Krin says he does against Eliakim and a lot of the snakes is he picks a god and he picks a god and simply prays. When he throws out his aerials, he's like, "Yo, I'm hoping this space is auto spaces itself, dog." Let's toss the dice a little bit in this matchup. Let's see what happens here. Eliakim already at the disadvantage, and Krin doing such a good job as always. Getting back onto stage. Yeah, he says that. I already know he knows what to do. He literally rinse and repeat, edge guard it out, Look baby. Look at this. Good job. Yeah, getting oh, caught by almost the gets, almost get dropped. And that's gonna be a very difficult thing. Like him's best to avoid the air at all costs. We're hitting a little bit of teabag action on the uh, the butterfly bomb. Just slight. <laughs> and now having Arsene getting a little camping action going on. This may or may not be doing crit in here, having to get back, but Arsen goes away this time. No two frame Nikita's for you, my friend. Oh, like him went again with that jab attack. He's got to be careful to continuously do that. It's going to be read by Krin. Up tilt right out of shield. Nice job. Yeah, Krin weapon brow a little bit. Like, oh, damn. Lost that sock Sheesh. to the nair, baby. Not yeah. crossing up for the up tilt, because that up tilt hitbox, it is basically like a jump scare. It comes out so fast, kills Matt early, and all right, having the tech here with Arsene. Oh, Krin nice hanging around. Tech. Able to stay in Arsene's back, but Eliakim him feeling so confident and comfortable, not phased at all by this. The bringing Arsene out, let's see what happens. Yeah, very good conversion into the dash attack there, getting some solid damage. And like him, you know, going for a lot of these high recoveries, something he picked up during Madasi's set, instead of just going to that ledge and recovering where Joker can kind of just trap you with the downers. But all right, still having to come nice back. Nice but... No, that's going to be unfortunate. And this is the problem that Eliakim is going to face in this matchup. It's like getting from the air to land against this Arson who is covering the ground so well, able to maneuver and take advantage of wherever Eliakim lands. And we saw that in that stock. Yeah, but I already know that Eliakim can bring this back to even nice and quick. You do still have the ledge here, and it's time to play the game, but no text for you. No text, good sir. Try better next time, and now we're seeing the grab. Can we get these conversions? A nice job. Yeah, cute little three-piece combo there into the dash attack, and still having the trap at the ledge with the grenade. Coming in clutch for Ellie out here, trying to interrupt the combos, but you're still having to dance around this Joker who is just jumping with that oh neutral right Oh my goodness, right and look at the way that Krim just puts in continuous pressure, is not phased at all, and like him trying to cover the ground, and unfortunately not going to happen. Yeah, unfortunately got parried a little too soon to try and get that dash attack in. And now sitting with all this rage right now, he's going to have to bring it back against Krim, who may have Arsene sooner or later, and there you go, right there. That's right, he's got to utilize this rage. As mentioned, and now we're seeing Eli came in definitely in the danger zone. And Krin capitalizing that shield is gonna get poked. And there it is, unfortunately. But good show there from Eli Kim, doing a really good job against this Arson that was all over the stage. Yeah, very nice empty up to kind of bait that option out. That was some very good stuff from Krin. And now Eli Kim gonna have to work a little bit more for this game too. But our, that Arsene was really coming in clutch for Krin there. I'm not going to lie. Now it's going to come down to the stage, in my opinion. Let's see what Eliakim ends up with because it's going to be so crucial making sure it's a stage at hit for his event, specifically against this matchup, so he can stop a lot of the movement, the ground movement that we've seen Joker so traditionally utilize in most of these stages. So let's see where we're going to end up here. Yeah, I'm a little bit concerned with how this match kind of went for Madasi last time, where Ellie was able to just scrap with Joker a lot of the time and force a lot of the interactions. Getting a pretty good lead was very scary because it's like, oh, I have to approach Snake. I have to force all these interactions. But we'll see how Krin switches to the tempo here. Right, already we're seeing Krin just holding on the advantage. And now I think we're gonna see a little bit more well-placed uh, grenades here again because you've got these two platforms. Let's see if the Lycan can take advantage of that. Ooh, air dodging back onto stage is going to be a mistake against Krin. Yeah, and Ellie mixing up the recoveries this time around, going with the low and the high this time around to try and get back. 
But you do have some even percentages here, but Arsene you know, might be a strong factor to taking a potential stock very early if Ellie's not careful. Oh, he's got to pay a little bit more careful. And that's what I'm talking about. As soon as Snake is in the air, it is all Krin's game, and you see him end that stock so quickly again via aerial. Yeah, Krin got the super fast buttons that he can just press against Eliakim, which is really doing it. I mean, and Eliakim really needs to make this stock kind of happen here, oh. but it's a tough, it's a tough order against the Krin Joker. That's, That's for sure. That's right, for sure. We're seeing that missile pressure. No one's home. Krin. Doing a good job recovering against Eliakim's ledge guard, and that is going to do it. An up tilt out of shield. Classic snake. Yeah, you already know the deal, yo. Okay, hit you with the snaky leg real quick. Hold his jump scare, my friend. The snaky leg. The snaky leg. The snaky leg. But all right, Ellie trying to just get this back to up to even. But you already know Arsene going to be coming in clutch real soon for Crane out here. But still, you got to just trap these lands as well with the grenade. Got to watch him press these buttons, but it's all up on that shield, and oh. Ooh, nice job getting back off with that bear. Oh, Grenade is going to work against his disadvantage there. Good bear on the way back down, and Kryn knows that he's got this. He's able to, I, did I see oh. a counter? Nah, he was, um... I, I don't know why I saw a counter flash for, like, 0.5 seconds or something. He was just trying to hang around to get, I like, see, the some back air. All right, Critton working real good with this lead out here. I already know Ellie is going to be fiending for that up tilt, which oh is going to be a sure kill. Once you get some solid down, like, around like 110, 120, that up tilt should be killing. I can see that this is taking a little bit of a toll against like like Kim's uh, confidence. He's kind of playing a little bit unsure is oh, how I'm wow, seeing that here. Wow, well, I don't know. Why did that strike throw miss? Oh, okay, the down tilt putting in pressure again. Let's see. Not seeing too much of a grenade play as we're used to seeing Eliakim. Good recovery. Yeah, he's still got to shut down the stock from Kryn, who is slowly building towards that Arsene. But once you knock it off with an up tilt or a dash attack, you know, he's going to have to build it for a little while longer. This is such a tough matchup for Snake, and there's the bear. He's got to end the stock. Patience not going to happen again. Kryn is a punishing. Wow. That and was there it is the punishing. Did you see that, bro? About. Punishing Snake on the recovery classic. There we have it. I don't know if you saw it, but Ellie was laughing it up on the camera over there. He's like. <laughs>